Welcome back to Underwater Math. I'm Verde, your friendly neighbor alien. Let's build our skills solving money problems. When we add and subtract money using decimals, we can use the same strategies we use when we solve whole number addition and subtraction problems. I bought an item that costs $1.85. I gave the cashier $2. I want to know how much change I will get back. $2 minus $1.85 equals 15 cents. To solve, we can count up 15 cents or we can subtract using the standard algorithm. Since we can't subtract 5 from 0, we have to borrow from the let's see ones place since there's also a 0 in the tenths place. The 2 becomes a 1 and the 0 in the tenths place is now a 10. We borrow from it and the 0 in the hundredths place is now a 10. 10 minus 5 is 5. 9 minus 8 is 1. I'll get 15 cents back. I have $4 in my piggy bank. I just earned $2.50 from completing my weekly chores. How much money do I have now in total? Let's use addition to add the two amounts together. $4 plus $2.50. I like to add zeros to help me either add or subtract. 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 5 is 5. 4 plus 2 is 6. I now have $6.50. I'm rich. Thanks for stopping by to build up your money problem solving skills. Keep practicing.